Parents are fuming in Garriston Beach. They're demanding a street light that has yet to be installed at a dangerous intersection. Now, they say they're down a crossing guard. Our Heather Abraham spoke with parents today outside PS277. Speeding is easy on Garrison Avenue. No lights, no stop signs. But along the strip is PS 277, where hundreds of kids cross the avenue to get to school. An area parents say is more dangerous now that one of their crossing guards was taken away. Cars are flying, you know, it's a school. There should be something here to protect them. I've seen even cars run past a crossing guard. Up until this year, the Parent Association president says there were three crossing guards manning the school. This year, there's only two. Dealing now with less guards, parents in the community are also still waiting for a flashing yellow light at Garrison and Channel Avenues promised to them by the Department of Transportation. To me... It's a no-brainer. We actually don't want one. We need it. The Parent Association also says the school has made a request to the 61st Precinct to replace that third crossing guard. Each precinct has a certain number of crossing guards. They divvy out the guards as needed based on requests. But according to the association, the school was told that there's no guards available right now. In the meantime, the Department of Transportation last told News 12 it's putting the flashing light in as soon as possible. And taking away one of their crossing guards is really just the icing on the cake. Parents are so aggravated and they fear now that it will take something tragic for them to get that light they've been fighting for. Reporting in Garrison Beach, Heather Abraham, News 12, Brooklyn.